أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم أمين أو يس 10 minutes he gave me 15 minutes I'm going to spend 10 minutes أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله الحمد لله الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على خير الأنام محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين يا أخوتي في الله ألقي إليكم تحية إسلامية طيبة طازجة قائلة السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Distinguished scholars I would special citation to a Sheikh Ahmed Bukhari Al Mukhtar, founder Muhammad Rasulullah Global Family, and Al Huda Islamic Society of Nigeria. All protocol duly observed. Brothers and sisters in Islam, esteemed participants, once again I greet you in the most perfect model of greeting. May the peace and blessings of Allah be showered upon every one of us. My job here is to give an overview of this very important conference titled Religious Moderation in the Life of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Please, I'll just run through the slide and uh, the background to this conference. For every gathering of this nature, there must be the baseline. Why are we here? And what are the issues that this conference will solve? And that we're looking at different crises facing our Ummah in this recent time the quest for leadership and control, political dominance, and the urge for mundane task, backlog of unresolved historical issues, and lack of understanding of essence of leaders, leadership and followership. The conference objectives. What we intend to achieve here, and at the end of this conference, we want to measure this, if we're able to evolve a moderate trajectory for the Ummah tapping on the prophetic approaches. To restore the Islamic teachings of moderate practices, explore historical and contemporary shatters of Islamic moderation, such as the Medina Shatter, the phase, phase is in Morocco Shatter, and the Abu Dhabi Shatter of human confraternity, among others. Disseminate information and action stroke implementation plan to enhance intra-Muslim understanding and collaboration, entrenching behavioral changes of one Ummah irrespective of our different ideologies. Our strategy. This would be achieved with the following. The conference activities that we could be having today, one. We'll be having two high-profile presentations. One, infidelity and innovation, threats and consequences to building a sustainable human um, uh, united UMA by Professor Saeed Oluritimitime, Senior Lecturer, Department of Foreign Languages, Lagos State University, Ojo, followed by building a sustainable uh, United Muslim UMA through moderation by Dr. Muhammad Noreen Ashafa, co-founder and director of Interfaith Mediation Center at uh, Kaduna. Strategy two. There will be a panel discussion. Our panelists are here, and we'll be having four panel discussions. And these will involve four respective, uh, respectable, um, three respectable men and one woman. One will foster, will look at fostering a strong brother among different sects, a call towards a responsible ummah by Sheikh Abdul Razak Waliola Afakallah, founder Al Mubin's International Islamic Society. The second one will be exploring trajectory 
of moderation to foster peace and understanding among Muslims by Sheikh Lukman Yemi Adeyemo, founder Markaz Anzawiya Rawdot Muhammadiyya Al Ibrahimiya Atijaniya, Houston, Texas, United States of America. My phone. Okay, sorry. The next one will be. No, I've not mentioned the one. You have jumped the slide. The next one will be the prophet moderate practice for women. And we'll be looking at that from the women perspective by Sayyida Maryam Olaju Magabagore Onikijika founder M um, Maryam Onikija Bagore Foundation. Then the last one will be strengthening intra Muslim understanding for sustainable impact and development by Dr. Mustafa Ballo, senior lecturer at the Department of Religious and Peace Studies, Lagos State University. Strategy four. And that will be presentations. We'll have a breakout session where this time we want the participant to also bring forth their experience and expertise in terms of addressing the issue of extremism and radicalization through moderation. And this time we'll have about three thematic questions that will be asked each group. We'll have three groups and each of these groups will answer these questions and give us a presentation. The last one presentation and after this presentation we'll be inaugurating the first time in Nigeria I say the first time in Nigeria an international religious moderation center that will be housed here the office is already provided and this is an initiative of the crown prince of Saudi Arabia Prince Salman and we are bringing this to Nigeria for the first time and that is the whole essence of this conference thank you